Are we live? No. Why not? You said five minutes only. Well, you can be live for five minutes. Longer than that. I'm only giving you five minutes. So that's why I put in the video. So you're gonna put video. it in the video? Yeah. Okay. Hi, we're live. <laughs> Is that live? <laughs> we're not live. <laughs> All right. Don't mass construction at its best. There's my garage. 28 by 56. This area here is the parking garage. This area over here is the workshop. That's going to be insulated. This is going to be non insulated. Just for parking cars, storage, you can maybe throw a lawnmower in there. Miscellaneous. Garage, you know what you put in the garage, everybody's got one at home. Look inside of your garage, see what you got in there. That's probably what's going to be in here. Except for all that junk food you guys eat. Should <laughs> go with the inside of the garage. I gotta put the exterior service doors in yet. Two of them to put in. Other than that, it's uh all done. There's a pile over there. That's the aluminum soffit and fascia and stuff. And there's one more piece here. I gotta bring in over here. And it's actually not aluminum soffit and fascia. This is actually steel. I don't buy that cheap shit. steel soffit material, the steel fascia material, and uh, uh, two marks of lumber I'm going to use here. i got to build some racks in here for storing lumber for my woodworking projects. Uh, I'm going to put a shelf all the way across this wall at eight feet and up, just to store junk that we don't need. It's all two by six wall construction. Uh, half inch OSB on the wall is going to get vinyl siding and steel soffit and fascia. Overhead doors are 8 by 10 foot. Here's the workshop area. Furnace is going to be up here in the corner. Uh, it's going to be table saws, shapers, planers. Router table, CNC router system in here, uh, and four other things, but uh, this is going to be the workshop area. This garage door is going to be insulated, seeing this is going to be heated. So this is going to be an insulated garage door, it's going to be glass in here, so just let more light in the shop. These walls are all going to get insulated, ceiling is going to get insulated. And uh, then I'm going to draw on the plaster of the walls, get one get, uh, plaster of the walls with one coat of finish, and it'll be nice and bright and white in here. Uh, I'm not going to put no plywood on the walls or OSB. After I insulate, I'm going to put drywall on or plaster board and uh, plaster it. I want to keep it white and bright. You put plywood on the walls and you get sawdust in here. Even though it's painted and it's finished, all the dust is going to stick to the, you know, there'll be dust sticking to this, cobwebs hanging on it and stuff, and I don't want that. I want to, I'm not worried about banging and denting the walls. If I bang them and dent them a little bit, it, it is what it is. I want to be able to see. So that's why I got nice glass in here. Uh, so not just for ventilation, but for uh, get some good light in here, and that's also why I'm putting lights in the garage door. So, that's the gist of it. Anything else you want me to say? Um, boo! <laughs> boo!
Thank you for watching. So, uh, after I get, uh, siding guy is gonna be here in a week or two, he's busy. Uh, as soon as he gets there, it'll take him, I think, him and his crew, there two days, so I'll have the siding and soft and base on. Get him done and get him out of here. Got to get the excavators back. We're going to get this all graveled up. Gravel parking on the right side of the building so I can park one of my trailers over there. And a uh, place to turn around, park my tool trailer. And also when we're here, we've got to trench in the electrical line. And the electrical line is going to be going from over by the electrical meter. They're going to be trenching the line from there. Over to right here is where the electrical is coming in to the garage. And then there'll be a, uh, the breaker box will be right here. And that's about it for this adventure. Are you happy now? Yes. All right. So all I can say is like and subscribe because if you don't subscribe, you might kick me off. <laughs> but again, you might not. <laughs> and here's here I am. Thank you guys for watching.